All right, we came back to exponent rule right here. Uh huh. You remember this? Mm hmm. Okay. We treat this one like okay. I call this one like a baby, but hey, I'm gonna call this one like a U. Okay, this time. Okay. Then uh, we can find out this one. So U equals uh, then two x minus eleven. Uh huh. Now, okay. What about this then? All right. Actually, we are looking for d y. You remember that? d y over okay d x, right? Okay. Now, uh, the bottom and the top. Okay. We just multiply the same thing, just like this one. Okay. D u. How about that? Uh huh. And d u. All right. So now, okay, wait a minute. Then we can separate this one like this. Okay, dy over du times du over dx. Oh, now, all right. Wait a minute. That means the left hand side is actually y equals not anymore this. Okay, not anymore this one. So we treat this one like a u third power. That means how you do this one, dy du, dy over du. That means, oh, 3u, okay, then you, uh, third power minus 1, which is uh, the second power, right? Times, uh -huh, the second one right here, du over dx. Oh, we derivative on this one, right? That means, wait a minute, that's right, this one had 1, 1 times 2, which is a 2, uh, then x, the first power minus 1, which is 0 power, is going to be 1 anyway. Okay, so, oh, that's it. All right. So now, the answer is, okay, 3 times 2, which is 6, u to the second power, which is the final answer is 6 u to the second power. Wow. So actually, we were looking for dy over dx. But we use the, this baby, this baby, so like a chain. That's why we call this one chain rule. Oh man, beautiful, right? Chain rule. Fantastic. All right, then one more sample of derivative of chain rule or chain rule of derivative. All right, let's try it. Wow, big shape, right? Uh huh. Then now we're going to borrow u, right? Okay, so you don't have to borrow u. Maybe you can use it b, a, whatever, okay? Then u uh, is, okay, 5x to the third power, okay, minus 3x, okay, then plus 7. Now, then, now this portion right here, like I call baby, is it u. All right, then the y equals u to the fifth power. Then, Wow, that means dy over dx. Now, we multiply, okay, top and bottom, okay, du over du, right? Okay, so now, uh-huh, think about it. dy over du, okay, which is this way right here, okay, which is dy over du times du over dx. <laughs> Very simple. Now, first of all, dy over du, okay, that means uh, u to the fifth power, that means okay, 5, u, uh, then minus 1, right there, so the fourth power, right? Times. Oh, very simple. Now, du over dx. Uh huh, we're gonna do derivative on this portion right here. Okay, that means uh, 3 times 5 is 15. Okay. Okay, then x to the second power, then minus what? That's right, 3. Ooh, that's it. Okay. Multiplication right there. So, final answer is what? That's right. This one times this one, which is 75. Then u to the sixth power, minus. Okay, 3 times this one, 15. Okay. And uh, x to the fourth power. So, either way, actually, uh, you can, uh, uh, this can be good answer. Also, hey, 
you can change this one shape like this one so you can pull three out so three times this one is a 15 outside u to the fourth power and uh, actually uh, this one going to be 5x to the second power minus 1 now think about it this u right here instead of this u all you have to do what you just plug this one okay right here okay this one this one is u right there okay let's plug in so final answer is like this one 15 then 5x to the third power minus 3x plus 7 then this one says the fourth power see oh man still big number right so fourth power times okay so 5x to the second power minus 1 Ooh, that's it man so you just calculate all this one okay so hey in